I promise you, the day will come when my room is actually a little bit cleaner than normal. friends, my name is Jeremy and today I'm going to be reviewing the Disney Store 12 inch Prince Naveen doll. Now I'm going to be completely honest about Prince Naveen, he is my least favorite Disney prince of them all. However, this is a kick butt doll, let's just be real. So the reason why I don't like Naveen is because I don't think that he was a very good prince for Tiana. I think that he's kind of a selfish, stuck up twat. I get that he gave up his dreams of being a twat forever to marry her and to be like her prince, but still I think he was kind of a selfish douchebag that his doll is gorgeous. Can we just appreciate this face sculpt because he's got such a defined jawline here. His face is beautiful, way prettier than his face in the movie. He, I like that he has the plastic hair for once I really, really like it on one of the prince dolls because I think that they were able to style it in a way that you couldn't have been able to do it with real hair. As for his costume, he has this green cape which does come off, for, it's got velcro on the front. He's got these poofy snow white sleeves on the side, he's got this cool little pattern right here on the front. He has this belt here which has this little flower on it, and the belt appears to move, but then again we have the exact same problem that we have on many of the dolls, is that the belt doesn't go all the way around to the back. With this doll, I have the same comments to make that I had about Shang, is that I like how many colors are present on here. Even though they're all about the same earth tones, they're different. There are a couple different shades of green here, there are a couple different shades of brown. I, I just love the way that his costume is just so earthy looking, and it reminds me so much of the movie. His boots are much different than other princes. He's kind of got this half gay, prince charming, half manly... Prince Philip and all the other princes thing going on. It's a half boot, so it slides on like this. It's it's very interesting, and it kind of reinforces the idea that he's kind of a tool, that his boots aren't even like legit boots. But I do like, and I will say about these boots, is that I think there's something that, that lily pad-ish about these, especially if you look at it from the top. There's just something that reminds me of a lily pad about it, and I think that the whole idea behind this doll was just to really reinforce that swampy feeling about the movie. And I, I really enjoyed the time that was put into this doll, because it looks like there was time put into it. The, the one thing that I am a little bit, con not concerned, but it's just like, it's funny, because every single one of the princes has underwear that coordinates with their pants. Every one of them. Naveen, on the other hand, has green underwear, and I don't know if that is because they didn't want him to look naked because if they had given him the brown underwear, like his pants, I mean, they're two totally different shades of brown, the color of his skin and the color of his pants, but maybe that's what they were afraid of, or maybe they thought that it would look like he pooped himself and it just smeared everywhere, but that is something that I did notice, and I was like, huh, that's interesting and kind of different about this doll, is that his underwear is different color. So he's the first Disney line prince who doesn't have underwear that's the same color as his pants. I do love his smile, I want to get to that, is that he's got this gorgeous smile here and he's got little dimples. I'm going to give you a little close up of that so you can see. He's got dimples. Please camera autofocus onto his dimples because those are just the cutest little things ever and it makes me like him a, a little bit. Not a lot, but it makes me like him a little bit. But because we are judging his character and not the doll, I'm going to give him a solid 4.7 out of 5 Duffies. The only reason is because of this belt and this doll is so wonderful and so perfect that it really is just upsetting that the belt didn't go all the way around and that's really the only reason why he loses points because I think that he is a fantastic doll. Now let's judge them on a couple set. Diana is slowly becoming one of my more favorite princesses and I think that she deserves so much better than him. But as far as these dolls are concerned, I think that the way that the Disney Store organized this, this is the swirly dress Tiana, this is not the new one. I think the way that the Disney Store organized this is that the two of them have costumes that are almost identical to each other. They totally complement each other. The tones are pretty much identical, except for his browns that are not existent on her dress. And even on the new one, they're not really existent. But they have so many of the same shades going on that they match each other, and I think there's something so cute about that. I think that they just look happy to be together. I don't think that they look upset like some of the other dolls. 
and I really like the two of them together. I think that they just look like a very fun couple, and it looks like they know that things are going to work out because they have love. So I, I really just like these two dolls together, and so I'm going to give them a solid 5.5 out of 5 on a couple scale. Each one of them has their own little faults, particularly on their dolls, but I think that just together they balance each other out so well that they just become a perfect little set. So thank you guys so much for watching. Tiana peed glitter all over my hands, so I'm going to go clean myself up, and I will see you all, all next week when I will be reviewing the last of my Prince line, and that will be Flynn Rider. But fear not, the Disney doll reviews will not end. I have many of the companions, so you will have those to look forward to in the final installment of my Disney doll reviews, which will be the companion dolls. So I will see you all next week with Flynn. Peace out. Figure months. Cool.